we've got an exciting package from PCBWay that we're going to open right now. Mark Fixes Stuff. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. You can get an instant quote on a variety of services, or browse a library of talented makers' designs, add them to your cart, and have them delivered directly to your door. Due to the house rebuild, I have had to wait ages to open this package. So long, in fact, that PCB Way is now celebrating their 8th anniversary. So happy 8th anniversary, PCB Way. You've always been amazing to me, so thank you so very much. And I need some new stickers. Right, let's have a quick look at what's in the package before we open them all up. First up is the Atari Super Salt Cart. Next we have an open C64 saver. Bubbling to the top of the box we have an Amiga 500 plus one mega RAM card. Next we've got, well, whatever this is. I've forgotten what I've ordered. Oh yes, it's an Amiga A600 fast RAM expansion. a C16 joy adapter, we also have an adapter to use a PlayStation controller on an Amiga, an adapter to use a Mega Drive pad on an Atari 7800 and an Uno Kart 2600, a Mega Drive pad to MSX adapter, a custom PCB for Usagi Yojimbo on the C64. A tape cart micro SD board. And lurking in the corner of the box, a sexy PCB way pen. Let's have a detailed look at those boards. First up, we have that nice little RAM expansion for the Amiga A500 and Plus models by C64 Istanbul. On the back is a handy list of compatible RAM. Also by C64 Istanbul, we have the Super Salt Diag Cart for Atari 8-bit computers. This board can be used for most 8 and 16K Atari ROMs as well. Useful. Here's a bit of a weird one. Suko Pera has made an adapter to allow you to use a PlayStation controller on an Amiga. I'm not sure why I'd want to do that, but it looks interesting, so let's make one. Also by Suko Pera, this little board is a superhero. It's a device that saves C64 computers from faulty power supplies that can murder them silently. I definitely need this for my peace of mind using my Commodores. Suko Pera has also released this board an A600 fast RAM expansion based on work by Kipper2K. It literally fits on top of the CPU. This is the Uno Kart 2600, a low-cost multi-cart for the Atari VCS. Based on the STM32F microprocessor, it's brought to us by Nihai Spy. This little board by Suko Pera is an adapter for the C16 and other 264 series Commodore computers that allows us to use 9-pin joysticks instead of the 8-pin DIN variety. Again in controller adapter territory, the MSX Mega Adapter by Tor Eirik Bakalunda allows us to use a Mega Drive pad on an MSX series computer with two button support. Back in the day, I loved the game Samurai Warrior, the battles of Usagi Yojimbo, so I'm really excited to make this custom C64 ROM cart of the game. Snazzy. The tape cart micro SD uploaded by C64 Istanbul uses the work of Kim Jorgensen to load PRG, TCRT, and P00 files via the C64 tape port. 
Finally, by Christopher Belcher, a Genesis or Mega Drive pad to Atari 7800 adapter. I've made one in the past, but this version can be cableized and is more flexible. Well, I hope you'll agree that this is really exciting stuff for future videos. Happy 8th anniversary, PCB Way. I really need some new stickers. Massive thanks to the amazing people who support Mark Fix's stuff. Without you, I could not do this. So thank you so much. Blimey, are you still here? Seriously? Off you pop, go and watch another one of my videos. Come on, I need the views.